Bob the drag queen. Dax, exclamation point. Cynthia Lee Fontaine. Chi Chi Devane. Thorgy Thor. You are all safe. And for the 100th time, safe is not a word I associate with America's next drag superstar. Now, you may leave the stage. I feel relieved that I'm safe. There's too much riding on this, and has gotten real. So I'm glad that I still have another day that I can prove myself. Oh my God! I survived the first elimination, and it's kind of a big deal, so I'm very proud. I could have done better, and I will do better next time, but I'm not going home today. Okay. Ready? Well, I mean, safe, yeah, but girl. I, you wanted to win, huh? Looking like a maid? <laughs> Girls, <laughs> the first safe group from the season. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yeah. Cheers. Yes, cheers, yes, cheers. Yes. The real question is, is that something to be proud of? I mean, Are we you know like, what, we're safe. Fight another day. That's all I got to say about that. Give me, like, one more chance. Give me two more chances. Give me as many chances as you can. Can I ask the obvious question? Yes, bitch. Uh -huh. Like, the most obvious what question. What is? Uh -huh. OK, who's, who's going? I have my top two. Oh, this really, is who good. Now we get two. to talk the I know, Betty. right? Finally. The top two is obvious. So when you stand back and look at them, who is it? Who do you Betty like? and Kim. I think Betty did great. She Betty. looks oh. phenoms. Betty and Kim are top, who is top, top two. Oh, like, they, one of them will win. You guys think there's someone else in top two? And, yeah, ask Betty and Kim cheat. Kim's makeup is better. Her outfit is more conceptual. That is out of the box, and that is a, a great silhouette that is totally conceptual, and I think it's everything. But are you jealous that, that you're Hello Kitty and she came out as a cat? Not at all, no, I love it. We're kitty, we're kitty sisters, we're fine. I think I think Kim Chi's gonna win. Yeah, probably, yeah. But is everything Kim Chi does gonna be some, like, crazy, crazy, yes. crazy I costume? I hope so. And if it is, I hope so. is that I gonna hurt it. her or help her? No, they're, they're gonna, you yes. know, Michelle's gonna be like, I wanna see some versatility. I wanna see you like, come I out looking fishy. More I feminine see or give that. more variety of looks. So who's going home? Oh, that's the and next segue. question. Honestly, well, honestly, the poodle girl. I think it's Robbie. I, I love Robbie. Like, I, I think Robbie is Robbie. a little Robbie. acting attitude, Robbie's but no, that I costume was amazing. Robbie's dress was not consistency, like no silhouette. I see like a sheep rock from a living room, like put it together on a body. And then like she got the caca on her hand. You know, caca in Spanish for us, that meat poop. I love my thing is this, girl, given so. so many hours, so many hours and so much fabric and so much cool stuff. She didn't do anything. She like made a white square. Which says to me, she doesn't know how to make clothes. No, I, I think she got overwhelmed. She made her opening outfit. That she walked in and. You mean the vintage silk <laughs> nightgown with the feathers? She didn't make that. She said she did. That was no, no, she, no. she said she hemmed no, it. The, no, the long no. thing. I don't think they're gonna send Robbie home. Robbie will not go Robbie's home. Robbie's too like, smart. She's very jinxy. But who else then. is like maybe in the bottom? Okay. Two. It might honestly be Naisha. Naisha's runway outfit was a piece of fabric with a pin in the shoulder, like a toga, and a cardboard corset. That was a messy mess. Do you guys know she's like, she was a former Miss Continental yes. winner? Miss Continental 2000. But she won the official title. Yes. She's like a dancer girl. She is a, a great, great, great dancer. Great dancer. Can everyone else smell the blood in the water with Derek? She's I, afraid. Yeah, she Derek is. Derek is like scared. Because her career is so locked in and she's like, she has made that brand. Her look is together. When she first walked in, I was like, oh, hey, Brit Brett. Like, I fully believe in the method, method of drag, but I feel like because she's been doing Britney for so long, it's harder for her to break out of that method. Derek's Christmas couture looks like an album cover from the 90s. Like, it feels like it's like, happy holidays from Derek Barry. Like, I feel like I'd see it on sale at Target or Walmart, like, in the discount bin. But oh, doing sure. more than Britney? She hasn't done that, done that in years. She needs to prove that she could go out of her comfort zone and do, and do something different. And do Christina. <laughs> and do Christina. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all, but I got to. 
Bro, let it go. Let it go. Get, get on top, man. Get on top. Uh, let it go. Bless your freedom okay. fly high. I like go. your pamper. He's there so we go. beautiful. <laughs> Chipotle burrito, you. bitch. Come on, harem. <laughs> what's it? What's it? Guac is extra. I know, right? Wow. Okay. Yeah. Right in tinfoil, like a baked potato over there. You know who shocked me? Who, like, who was, I was like, oh. Shocked me, shocked me. You. Me. You. me. You walked in, I was like, this bitch is nothing. Oh, oh really, you bitch? The moment you peed, bitch. You, you kept saying stuff like, like, you were sitting in this wig, you were like, this is my good wig. I was like, that's her, I was like, that's her good wig? All my clothes. Yeah. But then, like, she looked at her and she goes, I've never had this much fabric in my life to work. I was like, bitch. I have it. They underestimate me because I don't have all these fabulous lace front wigs or those thousand dollar dresses. It's very stressful not being able to afford the things that you need. I've seen many a trash bag gown, and your trash bag gown had so much detail. The trash it. bag bodice was everything. Like my You're downfall so is on. I don't have enough clothes. I don't have clothes to match you guys. I'm like TT from Set It Off. I need. This money. <laughs> I I found that this money. When you get real fabric, lots of real fabric, there's a wall of fabric, bitch. We are in trouble. When I first saw Chi Chi, I was like, this queen will not make it. But as, this, as soon as I started talking to her, I was like, oh, this bitch is smart. She's adaptable and she's willing. And that's really admirable to me. It really is. I have an idea. We should demonstrate our runways and then stand up and critique each other's outfits. Because we didn't, we don't get to hear critiques, so I'll, I'll like make comments. We gotta walk up. Yeah. You're gonna, gonna start okay. it with a purse. I'm gonna do the walk. Then I'm gonna you, stand right here, and yeah. you guys, you guys are gonna act like Rue, Michelle, Carson, and um. Uh, okay. So we're gonna impression it a little guy. bit. Okay. I'll be Nicole Richie, because I'm the skinniest. All right, here we go. <laughs> I walked in like this. Ooh, I see a the purse. purse. Ooh. I like yeah. tassels. Gone with the wind. Gone with the wind. Gone with the wind. <laughs> Come on, girl. Adeline, can you get me a sandwich? <laughs> Wear it, <laughs> Miss Hilly. <laughs> oh, look at those gams. Girl. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up yes. for Boy Yonce. Her legs made go forward. And then I was like, <laughs> Did you really? Did yes, you I really? feel. Not on stage, though. I feel uh, off stage. Oh. OK, well, thumbs up, sir. I, I like the outfit, but you're giving me very, like, cowardly lion from the Wiz hair, which I love. I think if, the, if there was a little more attention to the bodice, maybe I'd like it. What do you think? Um... It is okay, but I think that your alter ego, it's creating that you, like, discompose yourself on stage, but it's gorgeous. I don't know what you say, but I'll take that. <laughs> Next up, Cynthia. The realness. Uh, the realness. How do you say realness in Spanish? Que sabor. <laughs> My favorite game was always Candyland. That's just the candy man. Oh, there's, oh. there's the oh. candy crush saga. Yeah, <laughs> is that your real butt, girl? Must yes. be jelly, because awesome. the damn show ain't jelly. Must be jelly. Are you pumped as well? Mm -hmm. Puerto Rico, baby. Yeah. Puerto Rico! Yes. Can I touch? Can I'm I like touch? Obvious. Can I touch your... Obviously, can, 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 can I please? Oh, yeah, yeah. New York, pumping. Queens, this Question is not pumping. Do you have to massage it what so it doesn't get lumpy? Um, Like, once a week. It feels like an ass. You can feel it? So what, yeah, it feels what, like an ass. It always just feels like an ass. Yes, ma'am. Lips and hips. Pumps? Because everything is bigger in Texas. Yeah. I'm glad I get to see you guys today because because of how long we're in Drag Race today, we just like, mm -hmm. we look we better. Do it. Yeah. <laughs> we just look down. better today. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. What kind of challenges are you guys looking forward to? Comedy. What oh. are you looking forward to? Snatch game. Ooh. And ask who you're going to do, are you going to tell us, or are you going to keep it secret? Top secret. So, do you have well, any hidden talents? Have, yeah, I sing. Um, I'm a professional dancer, too. And I sing opera. I have a training. Oh. In drag, yeah, I won a. Uh, I want a crown in Texas, and I was singing live. Can I lip sync? Sing, sing something, I'm gonna lip sync. Okay, do it. My life, my life. One, two, three. My life. My glass eye explodes. <laughs> oh, thank good, you so good much. Job. Oh, thank you. <clears throat> thank you. I'm gonna stand up and walk around for a second. My kidneys are, oh. my ribs are trying to jump. Feel lucky, girl. They had to exactly. stand there. Them girls. They've been standing the They're entire still time. Standing up. Do you think that's exactly what's happening? That's right exactly now. what's happening. This whole time they've just been standing there while Rue is like. Well, thank you, ladies. I think we've heard enough. While you untuck backstage, the judges and I will deliberate. I 
think something's happening. Yay! Welcome back! Bienvenue! Welcome in! I am so jealous you guys don't the have your shoes on. Are here. Can we just look at you all and guess who's not happy? See? Yes, What's guess wrong? first. Is it not happy? Take a corner. Very happy. Not happy. That's strong. God, why are all these drinks gone, Lushes? All right, so Lelo, why do you look over it, like done? Oh, girl, I'm lip syncing. They why do you the... think that you look amazing? They liked me from like the top up and like thought I could have like done more and like grunged it up. They're like, oh, you should have blown up. They pretty much wanted me to have Betty's hair. And like, I totally felt that way too. They asked the question about being in the bottom two. They asked Layla, and they 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 asked you, right? But they hinted it at me. Layla said, "I don't belong in the bottom, but Naomi, Naomi does." I did not say it like that. No, I'm kidding. No, it wasn't like that. I was also the only one who kind of actually kind of had to throw someone out of the bus. The I'm bus. sorry. Why sorry? Well, That's how you I, feel. But it wasn't like I'm so used to. I'm glad you guys are friends because I thought you were gonna be like fighting back here. I'm so used to like. People, people hating on you? No, no, not hating on me. No, I people had thinking to that say things something. I'm so used yeah. to people like, being fine. jealous of me and my no. thin beauty. That's not. That's not what I'm no, saying. No, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> I love the two of you. I was confused by your critiques because it wasn't like all positive or negative. It sounded like you guys were like in the middle. Me? Yeah, both of you. No, I thought hers was really positive. Oh. Her, her, they were just, yeah. Derek's? Derek's was positive. Yeah. 90% of it was positive. Right. The, the only negative thing was What's like the, the simplicity. Yeah, the Britney a little bit. They thought this was simple. I'm the only one that got torn like a, I feel like I got torn apart. But you're gorgeous. But it would be gorgeous to send the gorgeous one home first. You know, the challenge was, you know, take all this crap and look fabulous in it. And she kind of did that. You know what I well, mean? Well, the final decision is Ruse, and of she course. knows that. Right, so that makes me feel better. I don't know. I'm you just, just mad because you got picked apart. Also, Girl, keep I feel like I'm the only one that got picked apart. I want my headphones. Nobody has their iPod thing with them. I have mine with me. May I listen to yours since you don't need it? I'm not feeling that confident right now because my ass is on the line. And I don't know what to make of the judges' critiques because they all started positive but ended negative. So right now, am I in the bottom two? Yeah, I think so. How are you going to give them more non-Britney? Well, the thing is, that's what I'm worried about, is Michelle said, I want to see more than Britney. That's and what I, was I told like, you. That's what Remember? I, right and, yeah, I and I said, just I do know. Britney, whatever. You look like her. They'll gag, they'll kiki and be like, give us more. Right. And you'll get past and, at least the first. But then Rue is like, I want to see more Britney. And I was like, oh, I'll give you more. And I'm like, ah, oh, I'm giving you Britney. Because Chad didn't get that kind of. Chad, no, no, no. This like, is the, the difference. Chad walked in as Chad, drag yeah. queen. He only did share in Snatch. Yeah. My angle is to come in as Britney. This is obviously what I do. It's what I want people to and see. Then change yeah, it from and then switch that shit up. I'm giving you drag pop star. Okay. That's what you're going to see. All right. But so I'm like nervous that. Michelle says, I don't want to see Britney, and it's like, I can't change this And she this said, that's face. my personal challenge, and you know Michelle. Right, but and I, I'm like, Next but week, I'm, she's straight makeup, up gonna be like, this looks like Britney. Makeup can change your face, but it's, like, it's almost like putting makeup on Britney. Not if it's a good makeup artist. Makeup can change your face. Kimchi's a lion. No, she I, like a cat I agree with that, but that's not the drag I do. Oh, yeah. I do I'm not gonna turn myself into a cat. Yeah, it's just not, that's not that's gonna be me. That's cute to your lip syncing, girl, so you're like, would have been nice to be sitting in the All back, right. honey. <laughs> Nasha should not be freaking out because she got told she's gorgeous. I got told, this is cute. I'm like, Look, okay. Look, are you cute or your outfit? Cute? They like, yeah, the outfit is cute. It's cu it is cute. Yeah. I think drag should be like fierce. Like, yeah, fierce. Uh, says this dress. Well, I, I know I'm fierce. Look, you look like Egyptian Morticia. You look like a runway model okay, and your earrings are the size you of your waist. Would you want simple? <laughs> Do you, would you want simple? What I'm noticing about Derek is what she's insecure about in herself, she points it out in other people. And I don't like that. That's not cute. This is why this is simple. You are doing the basics of comedy. Look, there's a reef on my That's comedy 101. I don't think what you did is funny, though. My, my outfit's not funny. I'm funny. OK. But I wanted comedy, and the judges got that. This is a conceptual, comedic outfit. I didn't throw on a gold dress and walk out on stage. I did what I did, and it worked. I didn't want to be simple. I'd rather be cute than simple. Anything else? It is simple, though. I think Bob thought that he was going to come here and not have any competition. And I think when I walked in, 
I was competition for Bob, and right away he wants to find my faults. Well, I'm not coming for you. Okay. All I'm saying, and I'm not saying you're bad or terrible or anything, I'm just saying I thought your outfit was simple. Okay. That's literally that's all fine. I'm saying. That's fine. Derek doesn't take criticism well. Like, when someone says, I don't like your dress, Derek hears, you don't like me. And if she doesn't learn how to take criticism, she might be in trouble in this competition. I don't even think you're in the bottom two. Oh, I do. I absolutely, the negative critique I got. Who do you guys got. think it is? Like, I think it's the two I honestly think it's Nisha and me. They gave you so much positivity. I got positivity only toward my photo. You looked like, different from everybody else. Like, the fact that you actually got on the floor, I, like, my thought was, oh, I'm gonna stand up on this chair. Right. Not, oh, I should really, like, take all space. the space. Yeah. And well, I, was so I have to keep doing this <laughs> over here. My biggest fear in the competition is drowning. You know, like, r really not being prepared for something that you thought you could rise to the occasion and you trip and fall. And I know in my gut, I'm drowning. I don't think you have anything to worry about. I mean, yeah, the thing, like, None of the, none of the criticisms are terrible. Yeah. Like, I, like, I'm so close to crying right now. It's not even funny because I don't know where I stand. I'm probably just really? frustrated right now. Yeah, yeah, I do. I am frustrated because it's like... Hey, ladies, okay. five in the morning. Five in the morning, main stage. I've wanted this for so long. I auditioned four times, and I cannot go home. I just can't. A lot is at stake. I, I go home to possibly no job, and the bookings can possibly stop because maybe they're not gonna want me there anymore. I'm seriously, like, terrified. Okay, ladies, Josh. Up. We are headed back to main stage. Everybody start heading towards the door, right? Ladies, we're headed to main stage. Welcome back, ladies. I've made some decisions. Nasha Lopez, Layla McQueen, I'm sorry, but you are up for elimination. The time has come for you to lip sync for your life. Layla McQueen, Shantae, you stay. Nasha Lopez. Out of 100 queens, you are by far one of the most beautiful to grace this stage. Thank you. And I'm sorry to see you go so soon. I'm sorry that I wasn't able to show you everything that I had to offer. Thank you, Ru, for this opportunity. Thank you. Now, sachet away. Now, good luck with all these monsters, Mary. <laughs> well, congratulations, ladies. And remember, if you can't love yourself, how in the hell are you gonna love somebody else? Can I get an amen in here? All right, now let the music play. I'm in such a state of disbelief right now, I have so much to offer this competition. And to think that I'm going home right now is beyond me. I just didn't have the opportunity to showcase who I am. I'm so happy that I was able to meet these wonderful entertainers. I have no regrets because from every experience you learn from it, I have learned that I can be so much more than what I do back home. And for that, I thank you, Ru.
everything I brought was like so like high fashion and just very fashion forward and not your conventional drag, so to speak, you know. As a kid, I wrote a letter to RuPaul because I wanted her to do a show because I could never be on America's Next Top Model. And I had to be on a show <laughs> that I can take pictures and showcase my talent some way, somehow. So this show has a special place in my heart. I'm still the beauty of season eight. Drag Race, Monday nights on Logo. See you next Tuesday.